guys. So obviously with the UCAS applications being accepted and offers being sent off, um, at some point you're gonna have to choose which university to go to, which is really exciting. So I thought to help you, um, I would tell you why I chose BU um, and kind of the like things that I looked for in a good university. Also ask my friends, some of them have sent in videos, some of them have just sent me messages. Um, I will include why they also chose BU so hopefully this video should be quite helpful. So one of the things that I was kind of looking for um, in a university was one that would get me outside of my comfort zone which is why I settled on Bournemouth because Bournemouth feels like a city but isn't a city. I liked how it still felt kind of homely and like calm with the sea and like the pier and all of that like it felt so nice um and like walking through the town like there were so many shops on the high street that I don't have um at my high street back home um and so I just found it so exciting whereas the other universities I was looking at didn't really have that they were just so similar to my hometown which is why I liked them because they were in my comfort zone but um, I'm so glad I picked Bournemouth because it's made me grow so much in confidence obviously the beach sold it to me I like in the summer like um, this summer just gone thankfully I was able to go to the beach with my housemates when we first moved into our uni house and it was honestly unreal it was probably one of the best two weeks I've had in my whole university experience. I felt like I was on holiday, but in my hometown. I also really loved the campus. Weirdly enough, it reminded me of my own school, which I think is why I felt so drawn to it, because there was that sort of like hint of a comfort zone. Like it reminded me of like being at my old school and sort of like being in a place that I was familiar with. But then obviously there was all these buildings, like the campus is huge and it's amazing. And the promise of the new pool gateway building which obviously hadn't been built at the time um was so exciting as well and it was totally worth the wait because it's so so cool um like all the camera equipment the tv studio is massive like um the sound studios i'm so excited to get back on campus and get back in the building i also really loved my open day experience like all my experiences at other unis were also good but for some reason the bournemouth one just shone out um Particularly, I remember being shown around the student accommodation and my guide was telling our group how if you get one of the top floors on any of the student accommodation, you're most likely guaranteed a view of the sea. Um, so then obviously when I picked Bailey Point, I knew it was gonna be a really, really high building. So I picked one of the top floors so that I got a view of the sea and I did. And it was one of the best choices ever. As well on the open day, um, when I met the TV staff, um, I got an opportunity to practice vision mixing, which if you don't know is like the live editing of like live TV. And yeah, I didn't get any practical experience on any of my other open days that I went to. And so like the fact that already before I'd even joined the university, like all the professors were like answering as many questions as I had, like they all seemed truly passionate about the subject and like they wanted to teach me even though I wasn't even a student there. Like um, just sold it for me. So yeah. Anyway, before I talk your ear off, those are the reasons um, why I chose Bournemouth University. I'm going to hand over to my friends Faith and Amy who are going to tell you a little bit about why they chose to come to the uni. So I chose to go to Bournemouth University for a number of reasons. One of the biggest reasons is the social life. I lived on one road, I think there was four or five other accommodations on the same road. Constantly surrounded by other students, which is great. And also because it's in town, there's not much of a walk from your accommodation to clubs, pubs. The social life is such a big aspect of uni life in general and I've made such good friends because of it. Um, campus life is also great. I mean, it feels like a separate world, which is quite nice to be able to like differentiate between uni work and uni life. And also on campus they have shops, they have a bar, and it's just great. I've really enjoyed being in Bournemouth in general. Um, so yeah. I chose Bournemouth University because I was looking for a television production course. It's the best one I saw. Uh, when I got on campus, um, the vibe was just really, really good. And obviously the location, you're right next to a beach, and obviously all the staff and like all the lecturers are so nice. And the campus itself and the facilities are the best that I've ever seen. So that's why I picked it. There you go, there's just a couple more perspectives um, on the university and like why people chose it. Um, I also have some messages from my friends which I'm going to read through. Um, 
All of these are different, which I really love. Like there's loads of different reasons why the university like shone out to my friends. So um, some of them are on my course, the TV production course, and some of them are on completely different courses. So this is like completely diverse. So a lot of people said the beach, um, like I said, obviously it's so nice being close to the beach. It's a nice way to like clear your head. Like if you're stressed out about work, going to see the sunset by the beach, is honestly unmatched as well like in the town there's loads and loads of places to eat um i have abused the fact that there's a wagamama's here and a taco bell also some people just said the overall location of where it is and um the nightlife i agree i think the nightlife is really good it's much better than where i'm from um there's so many clubs there's so much to do so many bars so like if you're not into clubbing like you can go for cocktails instead um like there is just so much to do and during the day there's so much to do like there's crazy golf there's bowling a lot of people on my course um and on the film course got back to me and said um that they'd heard it's one of the best places for media um and that obviously the university has a really good industry reach um currently at the moment um we're having a lot of industry talks from industry professionals and then overall people just said that the university had a really good repertoire obviously it's got a silver rating which is really good um, and that was definitely one thing that I looked at at universities like I wanted to go to a silver or a gold university this gave you some ideas on like what to look for in a good university I hope maybe it helped you to decide which university you went to um, let me know in the comments down below if you're coming to Bournemouth um, if you've applied to Bournemouth whatever um, best of luck to those of you who have applied but anyway so i'm gonna end the video off here i hope it was really useful and i hope you found it interesting and i'll see you in my next one bye